Thanks for checking us out at WXYZ.com. I'm 7 First Alert Meteorologist Chris Edwards, and we've been telling you for days and days that it is going to be very hot on this Saturday, and indeed the excessive heat warning will go into effect at noon across all of southeast lower Michigan. And the excessive heat warning goes all throughout the entire lower peninsula, so we have a lot of company in this. Heat index values in the metro Detroit area will touch about 105 late today. That's the combination of the high temperature and the high humidity levels, making it very difficult for your body to keep itself cool. Here's how it looks with the future cast. This warm frontal area moving through on this Saturday morning, and that's what pumps up both the heat and humidity today. Wind out of the southwest just brings more of both of those things in here. At least a little bit of a breeze might help cool us the tiniest bit, but it's not going to help all that much. You want to take precautions today to keep yourself as cool as possible. Future cast and stopping at around 5.30 on Sunday evening. A couple of isolated showers could show up off to the west of us. And after 7 or 8 o'clock in the evening, there could be a spotty shower here. But I think most of the activity will be farther to the west. You see that line of more intense showers and thunderstorms stretching from about Traverse City through the mid part of Lake Michigan into Chicago. Some of those storms late Sunday could be strong or severe. We're not expecting that activity in here, just the smallest chance of a spotty shower. No chance of rain today, though, but a good chance we break a record. The record high for this date of 96 goes back to 1931, and we could break it. Even if we don't, we're going to get very close, and it'll feel much hotter with the hazy sunshine. Overnight, it's a steamy when we only fall into the mid-70s again with a light southwesterly wind. And then on Sunday, a few more clouds, especially late in the day, but it's still 95 and it's going to feel like it's around 100 or so with that small chance of a late day shower storm and a little bit more wind, especially in the afternoon tomorrow. Monday is the slightly better chance for a shower or storm. Could happen Sunday night as well. But still, the humid high is near 90 on Monday. The holiday week is steamy throughout with a chance of a late day shower or storm each day. Even on the 4th of July, there's a small chance of that, but most of the hours of the days of the week ahead of us are going to be hot, humid, and rain-free. So do remember, among other things, never leave pets or children in cars unattended. Check on the elderly, drink plenty of fluid, seek out the shade. The air quality is not very good today either. There's an ozone action alert day in effect because of that poor air quality. So stay with us. We'll continue to keep you up to date all the time here online. WXYZ.com will give you the latest, and we hope you keep checking back in and stay cool any way you can.